family, welcome back to the channel Celebrity Scandalust. Now let's get into the mess. Kendrick Lamar's song Euphoria is burning up the charts and people all over the world are dissecting his lyrics. Well, Media Takeout examined Kendrick's lyrics and Kendrick appears to be suggesting that Drake may be linked to the Red Room of a Toronto man. Kendrick tipped off fans that he had snitch information on Drake that could lead to his imprisonment in Euphoria when he rapped the lyrics. We ain't gotta get personal. This a friendly fade. You should keep it that way. I know some shit about niggas that make Gunna wanna look like a saint. Gunna is accused of snitching on his former friend Young Thug and members of the YSL gang in connection with a Georgia Rico case. So what did Kendrick snitch on? Well, later in the song, Kendrick rapped, I be at New Ho King, eating fried rice with a dip sauce and blamey Crody. Tell me your cheese and fam. We can do this right now on the camera, Crody. And New Ho King is the key. You see, Media Takeout confirmed that New Ho King is a Chinese restaurant on Spadina Avenue in Toronto. New Ho King is also where a Toronto rapper named Sizzlack filmed his last music video. Sizzlack is also rumored to be one of the people that robbed Drake at GUN point back in 2009. Sizzlack's video, Realist in the City, was a diss track towards Drake and made waves in the city of Toronto when it was released. Shortly after the video was released, Sizzlack, real name Mustafa Omar, 29, unalived. The Red Rum is currently unsolved, but reports say that he was hunted down after being followed him by Goon, who spotted Sizzlack at the very same restaurant. Wow, family, that is a lot, but jump in the comments and let me know your thoughts. Is Kendrick breaking the snitch code or is all fair in a rap beef? Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video. Bye!